bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or... Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? I think an angel looks good. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Angel awaits you in booth six. Disconnect, please. Is that it? Guess that makes you a... Vincent, right? I'm Angel. You're Angel. Sure, why not? Do what you do best. I know that you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. That's why you're here. Look around. Tell me what you see. Listen, I'm looking for someone who worked here. Evelyn Parker. Know her? Know where she is? You must see the big picture. You focus too much on details. Minor ones. Like Evelyn. Please don't act like you know me. I just want some answers. But are you asking the right questions? How can you change what has already happened? Got only one right question now, the one I asked. Where's Evelyn Parker? Why'd the manager say she doesn't work here anymore? When was she last here? You know anything? These are questions to which you'll find the answers on your own. Stole this place to fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting. This. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. So what's it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died once already. Only to face another kind of death. Not about to come to terms with shit. In fact, I'm dying is an incentive. I'm running from that, living it up. You wish to leave something behind, a piece of yourself. That's why this all began. You wish to be remembered. It wasn't even that long ago. I was out to grab everything. And then, well, it all happened. Feels like that person wasn't even me. Still, if I gotta die, I wanna go down in history. Fuck it, even a footnote to do. And after that? Do you think death is a disappearing act followed by exactly nothing? People I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just some stranger's voice in my own body. Yapping away. Mm, no longer part of the world. You will still have an impact there. So you believe death is not the end after all. Reassuring. I think I might just be... afraid. So I imagine these things to distract myself from the thought of... the void. 
If what I saw before is any indication, where You are sensitive. That does not make you weak. Try to suppress your emotions, and you'll drown. So, where do we go from here? This is the part where I tell you what you must do. Oh, uh, okay. Be my guest. You've never backed down from anything, so don't stop now. Not one step backwards. In this city, people die on their way to the corner store for a scop pop. But that threat's never stopped you. You dive into the middle of it all. Always have. Things are moving way too fast. Around me, without me. I... I can't keep up. A minor delusion. The truth is, we and our paths are braided. Never-ending. Ever transforming. Not being, but becoming. And what's happening inside you, it could change the world. Listen, V. Never look back. If you must kill, kill. If you must burn all the world to the ground, then let it burn. Okay? Afterlife. What? What happened? You interrupted the session? Did I do something wrong? W were you not satisfied? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Wait just a sec. That's not how this works. You can't ask me about the dollhouse or anything like that. I could get in serious trouble. Go. Please, just go. Answer the question. Do it. And then you can get back to whatever it is you do. Here's what I don't do. Spill to any rando who walks in here. How about those good looks of yours? Be ashamed if they dip below club standards. Wonder what happens to a doll that suddenly goes ugly. Now, Evelyn Parker, where is she? There was an incident with a client. I don't know the specifics. One doesn't ask about these things around here. Tom might know. He and Evelyn were close. Go ask him. And please leave me alone. This incident with the client, what happened? Nobody saw, nobody knew who attacked first. It was all a mystery. Then they just buried it. No more questions, not another peep about it anywhere from anyone. Where did it happen? In her booth. Number? Eleven. Booth 11 occupied now. No, it's been out of order since... You're gonna help me. Need to get into that booth. Why? What for? Not your biz. Can you open it or not? I can, but that's it. Won't answer any more questions. Tom knows something. Go bother him. Tom, who's he? Friend of Evelyn's. Wasn't a free moment they weren't together. Where'll I find him? He's a doll here. Works the VIP area, booth two. Thanks. Shh. Don't ask for me again. Ever. <laughs>